guys and welcome back to my channel. I decided to do um, that burgundy smoky eye that um, I had posted on my Instagram since some of you really wanted to see um, how I did it. Um, this is a talk through step by step so you can really, um, you know, so you can really get in detail how I achieved this look. Um, it, is it is used with the BH Cosmetics 120 eyeshadow palette um, in the third edition. So, um, if you have that, great. If you don't, I'm sure the other editions probably have those colors anyway. Or you can just work with the colors that you have. Um, Alright, so, without all the jibba jabba, you know, um, let's just get into the video so you can see how I achieved this. Look. Okay, so, um, just getting, jumping into the tutorial. Um, as you can see, I already have my, um... My eyes, my eyebrows done, and my eyes are primed, and so is my face. So we can just um, start in with the eyeshadows. Um, like I said, I was going to be using the uh, 120 palette from BH Cosmetics in the third edition, and I started off with this brownie, um, orangeish color right here. It's um like a pretty neutral color take that with a big fluffy brush and just put it all, put it all in your crease sparkly burgundy color as you can see here this one right here and we're going to put this all over the lid with a flat shader brush okay so take that color and pack it all over the lid And you can also mix in with that color a little bit of this darker maroon color. So mix that in with it. Okay. Above the dark burgundy, because this one has shimmer and this one doesn't. We're going to take this color that doesn't have the shimmer and we're going to blend out that original color on our crease. Okay? So just keep blending. Okay? take another blending brush with no extra product and blend everything out. Um, then you're going to take another flat brush and a um, neutral highlighting color. I'm going to be working with all mattes today, so mostly. A neutral color right here. And we're going to put that in our brow bone highlight. As you can see here. Okay, now um, I'm going to go do the other side and I'll be right back. Now any fallout you have on your face, just quickly wipe it away with a regular makeup wipe. I know I look kind of scary right now, but just keep with me. I promise it will not look this bad. <laughs> okay, now once you're done blending out the top of your eyes, we're going to go on with our foundation. Um, again, my Rimmel Match Perfection 
Um, this one I'm in 102 Light Nude. I think they changed up the colors a bit. Um, so, this is kind of yellow for me, but, um, you know, I make it work. I know this seems like a lot of foundation, but, um, but, you know, girls got, got a lot to cover. And take your beauty blender and just Okay, so after you put on all your foundation and concealer and powder and everything you do to make your face look, um, you know, flawless, like that perfect skin that we all fake, you know, honey. Um, so we're gonna line, we, well, I already lined, um, my top line and made a wing with liquid and then now I'm gonna go in on the bottom. Um, you can use coal, a coal pencil if you would like to. I'm just going to use, I'm just going to use a pencil brush and, um, the black shadow that comes in the palette. And I'm going to use this to line my, um, waterline. maroon matte color and I'm going to run that under my eyes to smoke it out. Right here I'm just using a smaller blending, another smaller blending brush and just really um, blending it out. Um, to make it easier for blending you can take that same um, brownie neutral color, oh wait it was this one, you can take that same brownie neutral color and run it under there as well. It's just going to pull the look together and really smoke out your bottom lash line. Can you tell the difference? Smoked, not smoked. Now don't give up on the smoking. Really smoke out. Don't be scared to really smoke out that bottom lash line. Let and away. Now I'm just going to go um, curl and put some falsies on um, and I'll be right back. Okay, um, so we're done with the eyes so let's move on to the face. Um, for blush, I'm going to use this um, Mavi, it's called a plum. 
and I think this is by Lamcom. It's like a plum, pretty purple plummy color, and I'm going to put that all over the cheeks. For lips, you want to keep it pretty nude since the eyes are very um, smoked out. Lip liner, um, Peekaboo Neutral by um, NYX, and the L'Oreal um, lipstick in Opalint Organza. It's a pretty pinky nude color. Now, um, it is pretty pinky, so I'm going to add just a little bit of NYX, um, of NYX lipstick in Honey, so. Just to neutralize it a little bit more. Okay, so that was the okay. end of the video. I hope that you really liked it. Please let me know um, down below in the comments or something if you like these talk through be videos better than just um, the ones with like the music where I'm just, you know, doing it. If you like the step by steps, um, please let me know so I'll do more of these. And I am planning on doing a... Um, updated eyebrow tutorial since uh, some of you have noticed that I have changed the way I've done my eyebrows and um you know you want to see how it's done so uh that is going to be um coming up next so uh to rate comment and subscribe to my channel it is completely free if you did not know um it's just a little button down there you just hit subscribe and bada bing bada boom we're all good so um I think that's also um I love you guys and thanks for watching. Mwah.